In this code demonstration, we're going to take a look at the where and find where functions provided by the underscore JS code library. Now to make use of these, we'll actually need to include a reference to underscore, as I've done here through a popular CDN, or you can actually download underscore to your local project folder and reference it from there. The find and or the, the where and find where functions basically allow us to filter and find particular objects that meet that filter in a collection. So as you can see here, I have uh, a list of cars. Um, we have some Fords, Lexus, and a Kia. We have different models and some different colors. And so we want to write some different filters to allow us to retrieve the objects from this array that we're interested in. So we're going to come down here and we're going to create an object to actually store a result in. And we're going to say underscore dot where. And then we're going to pass into this our cars array. Now we're going to specify like a filter object. So basically I'm going to say I'm going to make the make Ford. So basically this is going to come to the list and return out to me. So let's see the result of this. I'll actually come down here and do a console.dir result. Switch over to our web browser and reload. We're going to see we get an array with two items in it. Let's see here, one is going to have a Ford and the other one has, as we would expect, a Ford. There we go, so we were able to filter the list and pull out the Fords. Well, we're not just limited to doing, um, to doing one uh, criteria, we can actually do several. So let's do a, um, say, color black. So we should now get back one car that is a make of a Ford and the color is in fact black. So we can reload this, and now we get back one. So there you go. That shows you how you can use the where function. Now the find where function is actually very similar to the where. Let's go ahead and reduce this back down to one condition, and we'll come over here and we'll modify this to say find where. Now what the find where function does is basically it applies the same conditions as we did before for the where, but it actually returns the first result that it finds. So now if I reload my web page, we'll see that the first result that I get is in fact the black Ford F-150. And if we go back to our um, array here, we'll see that the black one is the first. Now let's say I wanted to try, for example, the Lexus. can save that, reload, and now you'll see the first one that I get back is the Lexus IS-350, which is the first one in the list. So, as you can see, you can use where and find where to quickly search over an, array, over an array for a certain set of values and then get back a nice result set or a single result in the case of find where. And that can make doing searching to go a whole lot easier and faster and be able to find the models that you're looking for in the collection that you're working with.